Hi. So, when you're making product images for Photoshop, for Photoshop, for Facebook and Instagram, um, it's quite common to put a texture behind your product image. Um, and one of the most common ones is stone. Um, and you can find them on Google, but for the high quality ones, you usually have to pay money for them, and that, we, we don't do that. You can make your own in Photoshop, um, and it's really easy to do, so I thought I'd show you how to do it. So, head to File, New, and you want to change the aspect ratio to be square. So anything above sort of a thousand pixels will be alright. You want a high resolution as well. So I'm using 300. Um, come down here to make a new layer. Right click on the layer and convert it to a smart object. And then we want to change the colour to be about a mid-tone grey. And then we head to filter, down to render and click clouds. And for some reason Photoshop's not loading this little square, but it is there. <laughs> head to channels and we're going to make a new channel so that's going to be called alpha 1 and then we'll head to filter uh, down to render again and then difference clouds when you do that three times so two more times um, and the last filter that you use is going to be up here so we'll click that two more times and then we'll select the RGB levels again and back to layers and then we're going to go to filter to render again and then lighting effects and the one that we want is parallel directional so we'll click that we'll get rid of that blue and we'll change that black and then we're going to use the texture of alpha 1 um, and we can make that really textured or quite textured I think we're going to go about there 15 that's a nice number change the intensity to 100 and you can There, the exposure. You can change the exposure there as well. <laughs> I lost that a second there. Right, we'll go with minus 50. That looks alright. Then click OK. And there you go. There's your stone texture. Um, you can change the colour of it as well if you click on this little half circle here. Go to colour balance. Make sure you've got mid-tone selected. And you can change the colour with these little level bars. There we go. So there's your store texture. <laughs> Thanks for watching.